Contaminated soils are a threat to health and environment. By polluting underground water, suspending future development plans on site, and often leaving the owner with significant liabilities. For instance, here in Kristianstad, Sweden, where former dry cleaner caused a significant contamination with chlorinated solvents in the soil close to the drinking water resources. And is here in Stockholm, where the site had to be remediated before building of new apartments. Many in situ technologies have been used with modest success in reaching cleanup standards. This can be due to diffusion limitations, lack of contact between reactant and contaminant etc. To overcome these constraints, Veolia offers subsurface heating technologies such as electrical thermal conductive heating. Electrical heater wells are installed in the contaminated subsurface. Only heat is applied to the subsurface using renewable energy. The heat spreads by thermal conduction below and above water table and is almost uniform for the entire range of soils. The technology works in geologies ranging from gravel, sand, clay, all the way to solid rock like granite to any depths. Thermal conductive heating technology is the only in situ heating technology that can reach temperatures at several hundred degrees Celsius and can thereby treat any kind of organic contaminants with low to high boiling points like gasoline, chlorinated solvents, all the way to PCB, dioxins and even mercury. Contaminants are vaporized according to their boiling point temperature and extracted to the surface, vacuumed and treated in an above ground treatment process. The heating process typically lasts three to six months depending on contaminant type and concentrations. At the end, almost 100% of the contaminants are removed by electrical thermal conductive heating technology. The treatment of extracted contaminants in above ground process depends on contaminants type, contaminants mass, etc. Contaminants could be captured by activated carbon, destroyed in a thermal oxidizer or using other appropriate technologies. On sites with a high groundwater flow, we use steam injection because it can deliver significantly more energy than any other heating technologies and thereby overcome the energy removal caused by the moving groundwater. Using steam injection, we can treat volatile organic compounds and some semi-volatile organic compounds. In some cases, with special hydrogeological settings, the combination of the two technologies can be applied, which provides the most robust subsurface heating approach on the market today. Veolia in situ thermal remediation technologies are robust, proven, mobile, and can be monitored from anywhere.